Let's use Google Sheets to create a Mondorian artwork. Mondrian art. So first I want to see how tall my rows are. So I'm going to right click and select resize rows and I find that it's 21. Now I'm going to click on as many columns as I can, right click, resize, enter in 21. So now this should be a square. Now I'm going to go all the way to the end, hold down shift, right click, resize, 21. Okay. Next step is to add thick black borders. So I'm going to click this box in the corner so it selects everything. Select this button for the borders. And I'm going to select border style and go to the thickest one. And then I'm going to select all borders. Next, I'm going to merge some cells. It, this can be pretty random. Highlight some cells. It might be kind of hard to see, but I highlighted four of them. Right click. Ooh. And then click Merge Cells. And now, as you can see, it creates one big square. So I'm going to randomly make some rectangles here. Next, I'm going to add my colors. So this kind of art uses only primary colors, which are red, yellow, and blue. So I'm click on the paint bucket, and I have red, yellow, and blue right here. So select the cell you want to color. Select the paint bucket and select the color. Yes, I know I said that it's only red, yellow, and blue, but it's art, so you can do any color you want. And that's it. Now, with these other lines, we can merge that cell again. You can just keep merging cells until everything is clean. So the tricky part is that you can leave it like this. I, I kind of think this looks interesting. But you, if you want these lines gone, this can be a little bit tricky. So I'm going to uh, play around with it. I usually go no borders and then add the borders in afterwards like that. So again, no borders, and then I'll add the borders I want. So I want a side, and that's it. So see no border. Oh, this one. Okay, so. I'll just put borders around this if you want them. So that's what it's going to look like. And I, if, if this were my art, I would go around. But like I said, I think these white boxes look pretty good.
give it a try. Um, this can also be done in Excel if you have Excel.